All right, so now we're gonna talk about how to add and subtract matrices. Now there's two rules that you must know before you add or subtract matrices. The first one is that the rows of each matrix must be equal, okay? And then the second rule is that the columns of each matrix must be equal. And now what do I mean by that? Let's look at this example. Let's say we have some 3x3 three three, uh, matrix and we try to add it to a 2x2 two two matrix. Well, you just can't do this. You must add a 3x3 three three to a 3x3 three three, or a 2x2 two two to a 2x2. Two two. The dimensions must be equal. This is not possible. Okay, so now that we've got those two rules out of the way, let's start on our example problem. So suppose we have this matrix 2, 3, 6, 4, 7, 7, plus 1, 8, 3, 4, 9, 5. We're asked to find the resulting matrix. Now, we know that this matrix is going to be the exact same dimension as the, uh, the matrices that you're adding. Okay? So essentially adding matrices is you just take the first number of the first column, first row, and you add it to the corresponding first number of the first column, first row. Okay? So 2 plus 1. And then you move on to the second number of the first row and you add it the corresponding number. And then you just keep doing that. So 3 plus 8, 7 plus 9, 6 plus 3, and 7 plus 5. I find it easier to sort of write out what you're adding inside of the matrix and then rewriting it as you uh, solve for these numbers just because uh, sometimes I may add the wrong thing but this is like sort of a more um, focused way to do it, I suppose. So, I'd rewrite it. 2 plus 1 is 3, 4 plus 4 is 8, 11, 16, 9, and 12. Alright? And that is our resulting matrix, or matrix, excuse me. So, now let's suppose that instead of adding these two matrices, we were asked to subtract them. Now, it's almost basically the same thing except for your you're subtracting the numbers now so first number of the first row first column 2 minus 1 4 minus 4 3 minus 8 7 minus 9 6 minus 3 and 7 minus 5 simplify it all out 1 0 negative 5 negative 2 3 and 2 and there's our resulting matrix. And that's really just how easy it is to add and subtract matrices. Ooh, it's the end screen. Click on one of these links to be directed to that playlist. And don't forget to subscribe!